hey if you ever receive this error this site can't be reached it can be fixed in a few ways uh, let's dive in first check the i mean clear the browsing history and data uh, for that go to settings and click privacy and security and click delete browsing data and select last 24 hours and select all these and click delete data it should fix the issue if it doesn't let's look at the second method the second method is go to the control panel and click system and security and click windows defender firewall and you should be able to see turn windows defender firewall on or off click that make sure it's turned on so if it's if it's turned off make it turned on if it's already turned on just leave it let's look at the next option the next method is type this chrome slash slash net internals slash has dns and you should be greeted with this page and click clear host cache and check if if the problem resolves if not let's move on to the next one the next option is go to command prompt and click run as administrator once it opens type this command ipconfig slash flush dns it's gonna flush your dns and click enter once you enter that go back to your site and see if the error is gone if not let's change the dns server next is go to the control panel and click network and internet click network and sharing center and click change adapter settings and click on the one that you currently have the wifi settings right click and click properties and select this internet protocol version 4 tcp ipv4 and click properties again and over here click use the following dns server and type these numbers 8888888444 and click okay once you click okay and um you can go back and check if the problem resolves if it doesn't uh, let's use the next method before you do that please uh, restart your browser or maybe you can just close the browser and try it again so if none of them works it's highly likely it has to be uh, we need to release the ip address and renew the ip address once we do that it should work okay uh, go back to the command prompt again and run it as administrator and type this command ipconfig/release this will release your ip address once you enter that you have to type ipconfig and slash renew so it's going to renew your ip address this method should work if none of the previous ones didn't work out well for you all right if you have any questions please feel free to leave it in the comment section bye